Greetings and welcome to Smartwatch Ticks. Today we're going to take a look at a really, really useful application that you don't really launch, it just shows up. You can see it right here on my phone on the side, this blue bar with a little black bar behind it. On the watch, you can't see it at all, but it's there and we're going to talk about it. But before we do, I want to tell you where it came from, where most of these apps that you're going to be seeing here have come from. They've come to me from this source called Drippler, where my drips come dripping in specifically oriented to this phone and the Android operating system. Drippler is available for free in the App Store. I highly recommend it. The app you're about to see was reviewed in here as well as several others and it's just a wonderful digest of information that applies to whatever you're doing. And a lot of the things I get from Drippler are things that should be built into the operating system, like what you're about to see right now. You see the bar is still here on the side? I've made it really big and really wide and I've made it solid. It can disappear like it's doing on the phone right now, but you can have it on there all the time. And what it does, no matter what's on, it's always available. And it's a little floating screen dimmer. So if you touch it, you can brighten and dim the screen. Saving on your battery. Mine is set, as you can see, to 90% maximum. So I always have a little bit dimmer than full bright to give me a little bit longer time on my battery. The black section allows you to actually go below zero. If you've noticed, sometimes your phone or your watch might be too bright in the dark. This lets you take it down literally to minus 100% where it looks like the phone or watch are completely off or anywhere in between. So how does this thing work? Well, let's show you on the phone because it's a bigger platform. But all of these options are available to you and controllable on the watch as well. Where is it on the watch? Well, you know, it's just such a small screen that I tried it on the bottom and on the sides. You can put it pretty much anywhere around the periphery. Where I found it works best is right up here in the very top. See if I can get a focus on it. I've got it right here where I can slide my finger across the right half of the screen and set the brightness just the way I want it. I can still get my notifications by pulling down and pushing up, but I can adjust the brightness simply by touching and sliding in here. Is that incredible or what? Of course, to do it on a phone, you need a smartwatch phone that runs the op Android operating system and has the Google Play Store available to you. So you can download this app called the Free Display Brightness app right there. And then whatever you're running, whatever you're doing on the phone or the watch, you can immediately get the ability to control the brightness. There, did you see it flash? It'll show up every once in a while. There it is, really, really. I got so much reflection from above you can hardly tell, but it's, it's actually there. And if I brighten it up, there you go. Whatever app you're running, it has it on there. Okay, let's run through quickly what we've got. We've got the size, which is how wide the bar is, what your selected color is, and transparency, if you want it to be opaque like that or slightly transparent. You can do the same thing for the background when it's moved. You can locate where you want it. I have mine in the right bottom or middle or upper. You can do it across the top or the bottom if you want to. Whatever works for you. I tend to hold it in my right hand and like to slide it in the lower right corner on my phone, which is really great. Horizontal offset, vertical offset, so you can position it in case you have a case that you need to account for. The interval, I go from 1% to 90%, and then I allow negative brightness. This is a new feature that lets you take it down below zero and I can go all the way down to completely off if I want to. There's some options that you can select, including turning on the automatic brightness or not. And usually I have auto hide indicator turned on so that it'll just fade out like that after it displays itself. Okay, check it out for your phone, your watch, 
your your husband, your wife, your children, your dog, whatever you want to dim down sometimes, you have that control right on the side of your device or the top, wherever you put it. And it's called Display Brightness, available in the Google App Store and runs beautifully on your smartwatch phone. All right, thanks for watching. And please take a, take a moment and also download Drippler while you're at it. I think you'll really like that app as well.